Now, everybody, I want y'all to see that I've proven exactly what a false prophet Timothy Dixon is and that he follows me closely and steals my prophecy. So remember uh, uh, one of my most recent videos, I did a, a parable of his, of this specific prophecy he did many days ago about fishermen of men. And what I did was made up a, uh, I did a prophetic challenge to him, and I made up a prophecy to show you what he does, made up a prophecy that aligned closely with his, but had differences, had major differences in it. And this was his initial prophecy that he did about the, the two boats and the fishermen and Satan. Listen closely. And he's discussing the nets about casting out nets, how they were both, both of the boats were casting out nets. Pay attention. The man that was at the front of this boat that I was on, I know that it was the Lord. And he told me, he said, cast your net into the deep waters. And I began to hear that song that you just heard in the beginning. So that was his original dream that he was given. Understand that. And this was the dream that he told today that supposedly was his prophetic dream from God. And understand this. His first dream, they were using nets. And what I did, one of the changes that I made in mine was I said that uh, the devil was using a lower a lure, a, like a fishing lure, to lure people with Timothy, Timothy Dixon away from God. Now listen to how he changes now, just today after I do my video, how he changes his supposedly prophetic dream to match mine. Listen closely. Now see, that just goes to show you these are not uh, prophetic dreams that he's having. These are stories that he's making up, and he follows me closely so he could take and twist uh, my prophecy when I give a prophecy. He takes and builds off of it. He makes up stories so that he can use it to promote his savior, Donald Trump. Understand that, people, but he's prophesying for Satan. I prophesy on behalf of Jesus Christ, the only true Lord and Savior, whereas he prophesies for Donald Trump, his true Savior. This is what he's doing, people, and I've proven it now. And you can go to, go to this video, this was the one he posted today, and go to about the 48 minute and 48 second part in that video so you can hear it for yourself. Because I got so many people, his followers will attack me and say that uh, somehow I'm, uh, uh, what do you call it? I, I'm not that computer uh, literate people to go in. You see how crude in ele elementary my videos are whereas he has a whole team that works on his videos and does his videos for him i do all of my stuff myself and i'm not a computer uh hacker or scientist you can see my videos are crude so i'm not hacking his stuff and i'm not uh uh manipulating his videos you can see it for yourself at his newest video where he's uh, preaching in on the Choctaw Reservation and see this is exactly what he does. He saw that the story that I made up, because it was not a prophetic vision that I was doing, I was just showing how he simply makes these stories up. But he saw that my story was better than his. Understand that that the story I did was better, and that's why I called it a challenge. He challenges 
and see that I won the challenge. He liked my story better than his own, so he changed it using my stuff. Understand that. That's why he steals my prophecy, because my prophecy is truth. He knows it's truth, but he wants to steal it and twist it for his savior, Donald Trump. He doesn't believe in uh, how the savior, Jesus Christ, will return and save he believes that Donald Trump, and wants to have you believe that Donald Trump, the Savior, will return and save. See the blasphemy in the things that he does. See that he does not have uh, dreams or visions from God. He's just like one of these other false prophets. They troll around on the internet and they, they search out true prophets because, you know, Satan's people can find true prophets and plagiarize them.